Welcome back to This Week in Rideshare News. My name is Cecily and here are the latest headlines for rideshare, gig economy, and food delivery apps this week. DoorDash can't ditch drivers minimum wage claims. Postmates becomes the official on-demand food delivery partner of the NFL. Lyft lays off contract janitors while spending $17.5 million on Prop 22. And people question the validity of a viral video where a passenger records a touchy-feely Uber driver. It's This Week in Rideshare News. DoorDash must face a Fair Labor Standards Act lawsuit accusing it of failing to pay drivers minimum wage. A California federal judge said that during a remote hearing on Thursday, denying app-based food delivery services motion to dismiss after determining that drivers adequately pled that their fuel expenses outpaced their wages. This past Thursday, U.S. District Judge Edward M. Chen said that Jacob McGrath had clearly alleged that he made about $60 in delivery fees in a 15-hour work week delivering meals to DoorDash customers, and that after spending $100 out-of-pocket fueling up his delivery vehicle, he failed to make them federal minimum wage. So Judge Chen tossed out the driver's amended complaint in June, but granted the driver's leave to amend. So at the time, Judge Chen also warned DoorDash that it wouldn't take so much for the drivers to successfully replead the case. We'll keep you updated on what happens next. A viral video of a touchy-feely Uber driver has everyone debating its validity. The video, captured from Pax's POV, alleges that the driver stated that he dropped his phone behind him but keeps grabbing at the passenger. I've seen this video everywhere and it's not clear if it's real or not, but people have been having fun in rideshare forums debating the validity of the video. Here's a few snippets and just based off of what you see, let me know what your thoughts are. Uh, sir? Is there a problem? Okay, I'll look for your phone. I'll look for your phone. I'll let you know. I'll let you know. I'm looking for it. I'm looking for it, please. I'm, lo I'm looking for it. Can you please? Uh, I'll let you know if I see it. Is this the block? Uh, two more blocks down. Sir? Please. Two more blocks, is that? Uh, you have to take the turn on the right. Can you please put your hand away? No, I don't see it. It's not here. Must be. Yeah. You can look for it after after this ride, please. I asked you to stop. Sorry. What happened? League. The NFL names Postmates as its very first on-demand food delivery partner, which also makes Postmates a sponsor of the Super Bowl. Um, I think it's very appropriate for there to be a food delivery partnership, mostly because most of us will be watching the games from home. Now, the cleaning contractor at Lyft's corporate headquarters has fired janitors instead of furloughing them with the right to return to work. 63 janitors who worked for service by medallion were informed by text message that they would only get two days of work per month in April. By June, at least 90 workers received an official letter of termination and at the end of the month, workers say they will no longer have unemployment benefits. This is really crazy to hear, especially when you know that Lyft is spending millions of dollars to support Prop 22 that many people feel is exploitive for drivers. Um, this story is developing. 
And now for what would you do? I wanted to find something fun and this one caught my eye. This woman said that someone gave, gifted her this blue topaz ring. As a tip, what's the strangest or coolest tip that you've ever received? And we're not talking about money. So if you receive something from a passenger that they gave you and that, that, what you found, because I'm not really sure someone gave her this ring. I'm just kidding. <laughs> What's the best tip you've ever received? Let me know in the comments. Thanks so much for watching. If you have a tip for me, a news tip, you can contact me on my YouTube, Drive Girl Drive, or my Facebook, Drive Girl Drive. Like this video if you enjoy what I've done here and subscribe if you want to see more. I'll see you here, back here, next Saturday. Peace out.